Hey, what's happening everybody? My name is Harrison and this is going to be an Unreal 4 C++ tutorial on how to do set view target with blend. Uh, let's go ahead and launch what we're going to make right now. So push play and you can kind of see we're immediately grabbing the first person camera and setting it to an object that we defined in our details panel. Uh, there should be a GitHub link down below in the comments so you can always just grab the code and move along. But if not, let's go ahead and uh, recreate this in the uh, in C++. Uh, again, let's watch one more time. Uh, it's set view target with blend. So we push play, we immediately grab the first person camera and bring it to the actor that we set. Uh, <clears throat> the actor we set right here, we set, we created a U property and set it, and, and we set it to the editor cube and this is editor cube 11 and we set that in our my actor, actor. So <laughs> anyways, let's move along. Let's delete the test one and uh, that's not good. Let's delete that one and then move on and recreate it. So first step, create a new C++ class, choose actor, next, uh, set view target with blend. Sweet, it just created the files for us. Open up, so in the header file, we wanna add one thing, we wanna add, we wanna be able to edit the actor in the viewport, or not in the viewport, but rather in the editor. So we go ahead, U property, edit anywhere. Um, a actor, pointer, call it my actor, semicolon. Save that. Now let's move ahead into the .cpp file. Uh, in order to set the view target, or in order to get the player controller, we do have to include Kismet gameplay statics. So include, uh, what, I have to do kismet, right? Yeah, kismet, kismet slash gameplay statics. Uh, no, uh, gameplay, yeah. We include the header file, and now in our begin play method, let's go ahead and get our player controller. And we do that with a player controller pointer our player equals you gameplay you gameplay statics get player controller get player controller this and we're gonna get the very first one out of all the player controller controllers in the game world but again we only have one so it's gonna be zero uh, then from here we want to set the view target with one so our player how do you do this? Do you branch off it? Do you do this? Uh, yeah, set view target, view target with blend. And again, we're gonna go to my actor, the one we created in the header file that we'll set in the editor. And the blending time we want to be four seconds. You can set it to whatever you want. Four seconds will at least give us a jumping off point. Save that. Go back in the editor. Let's compile. Ah, sweet, it just compiled. <clears throat> Let's drag this boy in. Uh, set view target, um, my actor. Where do we want to set the actor to? Uh, let's set it to this guy, this big guy right here. Uh, what is that one called? That one's called edit cube eight. Uh, where's my thing? I'm gonna look for it again from the search. Set view target, we want it to be editor cube eight. Editor cube eight, click that. Now let's push play, see what happens. You can see that the camera is blending towards where we set it. We set it to that actor, and then there we go. That should be about it. Let's play it one more time. So again, we immediately grab, grab the camera and go to the actor that we set. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, I will see you in, in the next one.